All right, listen up. I know how important today is to you. We want you to raise your draft grade, create some value that you can use to shop yourselves to NFL teams. But you have to do your part. Relax as much as you can and just do your best. And we're going to start with a pocket movement drill. Now pay attention. I want you to take a five-step drop, and then I'm going to give you a direction to move in. And when I'm done, I'll yell ball, and I want you to throw it to that receiver over there. You understand? Move. 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 Ball. Nice throw. Who's next? All right, let's move on to the route tree. I want each of you to take a five-step drop and then throw the route that your receiver will be running. Let's see the first three guys throw. Wait, you're up. Can't hold on to a thing. Hey, keep get up. You know, maybe if you were throwing at me, I could make a play. Next up. I can't switch places. Oh, come on, D. I need this. Hey, I just can't, man. Son, are you here to play or to gab? Get back in line. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Let's see if Wade can throw this out. Nobody's been able to hit it all day. Great work, gentlemen. Now, for some of you, this is the end of the line. For others, we'll see you at the Super Regional Combine. All the best. Death? <laughs> I thought that was you. 
I see you still got that cannon for an arm. What up, Mario? Heard you, uh, you're in the Middle East or something. Yeah, something like that. Yeah? You still got them happy feet? <laughs> happy feet? What are you talking about, man? You sacked them, like, what, once in high school? <laughs> hey, no disrespect, man. I give mad props to anyone to give your boy here a full ride. Come on, dude. Anyways, I played fast. But them scouts are always talking trash on my size. You know what I'm saying. Okay, man, what's your problem? Yeah, let's, let's get out of here, man. Come on. Man, I had those drops early. Now he's saying I'm too small. I mean, if he's thinking it, then the scouts definitely are. <laughs> man, don't listen to Mario. He's an idiot. Always has been. I know. But is he right? Look, dude, you were great. Okay, you had one of the best 40 times of the day. Yeah, but not as fast as I needed to be. Devin Ward. Uh, it's, it's Wade. Wade. Devin Wade, of course. Ross Fountain, how would you like to be a TV star? And who are you? You're joking, right? I'm the executive producer of a new show, and I think you are perfect for it. We're gonna work with an NFL wannabe. Hopeful. Right. Uh, hopeful. For six weeks. Pair him with a Super Bowl-winning coach, and bring a zero. A long shot. Right. <laughs> it is the name of the show. <laughs> a long shot from the depths of the unknown to being drafted by an NFL team. We love your story, Devin. I, I love your story, Devin. We've been trolling all the regional combines, and I want you be our long shot. We'll do it. <laughs> we'll do it. <laughs> is he? This is Cole Cruz, Devin's teammate at UT. He's the other guy we circled. Right. Related to Tom? <laughs> I'm kidding. Although that would be great for ratings. You are the same height. <clears throat> nope. I gotta take this. Julia? I'm Julia Vasco, the producer of Longshot. We came here today hoping you'd be this good. And you were. But why me? Yeah, who cares why, Dev? It's a chance of a lifetime. Cole's right. You're probably going to get an invite to the Super Regional. But we offer first-rate coaching with a Super Bowl winner, first-rate facilities, and the latest in VR training. <laughs> See? It's a no-brainer, Dev. Yeah. I appreciate the offer, man, but yeah, I think I'm going to see where this path takes us. Maybe just take some time to think about it. I'm here if you have any questions. We will be in touch. So, you're in? Well, we've got a long drive ahead of us, so we better get going. They live in Texas. Driving? This guy is a freaking gold mine. <laughs> we'll fly you home to get your stuff. Devin wants to think it over. Think about what? The show? The sport, this is a once in a lifetime, and we start production in two weeks. <laughs> I'm, I'm just not sure. You know who else is not sure? Every scout here. We were sitting by two guys. One remembered you as the quitter from Texas, and the other didn't remember you at all. Hey. For horses. If you think the pros are gonna come calling, Think again. You need this. Time's up. Indianapolis. You have my card. No, I'm not kidding. Yes, ma'am. We should get going. We're here tonight talking about Louis B. Travis High School's Doyle Lawson. Just named starter for next season, and it's only February, folks. Let's go to Amy from Amarillo. Ugh, this has got me hotter than a pepper jack after what Lawson pulled last year. We're in a street fight with Abilene High, and this kid's moping on the bench with a dang towel over his head. Whoa, Amy. I'm sure you know his brother had been diagnosed with leukemia just two days before. I don't care if he lost his puppy. Hey, I was listening to that. That's the problem. People like you listening to this garbage. No, I was trying to stay awake. It's not like you're talking to me. 
What gives her the right to rip this kid? Huh? She, she doesn't even know him or who he is. You know, people think they can they can judge you based on how they think you should behave, man. They, we're talking about a high school kid here. Okay. Well, leave it off. Jeez. I know you think this reality show is a golden ticket and all, but you don't get it, man. Once this stuff comes, it just it just hits you at, at all directions, man, and it don't stop. Oh, come on, Dev. You can't take that stuff so personal. Colt, are you hearing yourself? That's the problem, man. It is all personal. That's all personal. Look, Dev. I know what you've been through. I do. But I'm telling you, man, I think this one is going to be different. Uh, uh... Breaking news, folks. Just three short months after his papa died and only four games into what was to be a promising career, Devin Wade has quit the Longhorns. Tons of calls pouring in. Let's go to the phone line. Now, the Longhorns invested so much on this guy, and now he quits. The Longhorns told the bag, Dad, uh, so what? You've got to man up. Why is this a bad thing? Wait through seven interceptions in three games. <laughs> Good riddance. On Twitter, we got at Texas Forever. 99, who says thanks to at 13 Devin Wade for ruining our season. What a total bust. How did the guy go from being one of the best high school quarterbacks the state of Texas has ever seen to this? I can't believe we were all fooled by that loser. We went from Colt McCoy to this. Oh boy, this does not look good. Oh man. Starting quarterback Caleb Young just took a big old shot on that play. Ouch. And it looks like he's done for the night. Kind of this game's getting out of hand. We need some spark. Something. How about those two freshmen? Don't put them in. Oh, Devin. You're up. This is it. I'm shy. No matter what happens, I'm proud of you both. I get out there and show them what you made of. Well, Randy, it looks like Coach Jamison has given up on this game. And maybe even a season. Freshman Devin Wade has just run onto the field. I love this move. Caleb wasn't doing much before he got hurt, so let's see what Wade can do. If he's anything like his daddy was, we might have a chance to salvage a season. Okay, boys. Let's, uh, let's go have some fun out there.